Jim McMahon's talking about players smoking pot for pain. Uh, do you believe that uh, the NFL players should be allowed to smoke pot for pain? Or should uh, NFL players continue to have uh, concussions, dementia, memory loss, CTE, and agonizing pain? And the only thing they get for it is uh, the league-mandated Toradol. There's a million players suffering with pain. There's a million players that have dementia and CTE and memory loss. And uh, there's guys dying. Do you think the league will drop the pot laws? Do you think the league will allow players to eventually, in the coming seasons... Not long down the road type decision. Do you think that decision is near? Do you think it is near within a year or two that the NFL will drop pot as a drug uh, that's on their banned substance list and let players smoke for their pain? Because, I mean, cancer patients smoke for pain. Sick people smoke for pain all the time. It's, it's a proven fact now uh, all over the place that people that are ill with cancer and the like and suffering... Uh, they smoke weed and they they seem to have uh, found a reprieve for 30 minutes or an hour. I don't have a problem with it at, at all. Um, I, what I do have a problem with is Roger Goodell being God. Uh, I have a problem with the commissioner of the NFL acting like he's the president of the United States and making decisions for everyone in their life about everything. Like he's in charge of the whole world. It, it's, it's, it's for real and ridiculous. I mean, run the football league, make the owners billions, and stop acting like you're God, because you sure act like it. Is he not the most ridiculous guy that's ever come along in a long while? Like, I never once thought this of Paul Tagliabue. I just thought he was a nerd. I never had a problem with the way he managed.